is my home I can feel it, baby Your love is my home I can feel it now Your love is my over the last uh, 12 months I've been um, listening to a lot of soul music and uh, I really wanted to try and, um, f for this album I wanted to try and write uh, a song that, that was like a contemporary version of um, like Memphis soul really. I don't know if I managed to do that or not but um, in the process of trying to do that I came up with the song Your Love Is My Home and uh, it seemed to me that um, a lot of those uh, those soul songs and, and writers like Dan Penn would always like just coin a phrase which um, which would capture the whole essence of the song and the most important thing is just that one phrase which is usually the title of the song and the main hook um, melody and everything so I, I don't think I've got anywhere near achieving that really but Your Love Is My Home is kind of that kind of idea where you just, just find a phrase that captures the whole essence of the song and that's the, the main hook and everything else um, and then um, hopefully, you know, just again using very simple chord structure and, and hopefully all of the soul ideals that, that existed in terms of the way that everybody played on that. I think everybody played really well in the studio on this song. It was one of the songs that was really, um, we would come into the studio every morning and uh, during the making of the album and, it, and everybody was looking forward to getting a chance to hear a playback of, of that song as it was uh, progressing because it just gave everyone a lot of um, it made everyone enthusiastic to, to get on with the day's work because everyone was so excited about the way it was sounding so um, I think I'm I really I'm happy with this one I think it's it's lyrically simplistic it's just a simple message it's not meant to be clever or anything like that and uh, for once I didn't write like a million sections A B C D E F G sections it's just got basically two sections and uh, Hopefully it works all right as a contemporary soul thing. Ain't no sense in asking questions. 